Hey everybody, it's me, the Golden Knight here, and today, this these are my opinions on why Mason and the original characters are not in the Black Black Ops Three, Black Ops Three campaign. Uh, and also, yes, I am rec I am showing some uh, adva advanced warfare gameplay, but I really don't care when I'm talking about Black Ops Three. I just don't want to play it that much. Uh, anyways, um. So pretty much, these are my thoughts on it, and also if you're wondering why, if any of you guys are probably wondering whoever watched my videos and why they're only 5 minutes, is because only on Xbox I'm only allowed to record for 5 minutes. So yeah, I just thought of saying that. Um, but anyways, let's get on to the opinions. Uh, first opinion. First opinion, maybe Mason has done some things that we do not even know. Just think about it. Just think about it. Like, I mean, the last time we saw Mason, he was in Vietnam, right? And then we saw him back in 2025. He could have maybe got married and maybe had a kid or something. I know this sounds ridiculous, but this could be true. And here's my other opinion. Here's my other opinion on why Mason and Woods and probably almost everybody who was in, Black, in the Black Ops series are not in Black Ops 3. Mason could be dead. That's right. Could be dead. I mean, because the last time we saw him, we saw him in Vietnam, and then we saw him in 2025. Black Ops 3 takes place in 2049. So yeah, that's also another reason why that could be the reason why he is not in in Black Ops 3 campaign, and why Hent Woods is not in it, because because they we first saw him like in Vietnam, Vietnam, and then we saw him in in 2025 in Black Ops 2. So yeah, that could be a reason why. That could be a reason why we, he is not in Black Ops 3. And also here, and also here's my other opinion. Mason could maybe have retired and all of his friends. I mean, just think about it. Think about it. I mean, the last time they saw, he's been in two wars lately, and he's been in a terror. He's been like in like terrorists. He's been fighting terrorists. He's been being in Vietnam. All that. All that type of things. So yeah, he could have retired because he does not want to be in another war, or maybe he does not even want to serve in another war. I'm mean, just think about it. This could be true. And also Treyarch, Treyarch and Vondi, if you are actually watching this, and these are the creators of Black Ops 3, just in case if you guys are new to Call of Duty. Um, so pretty much, I don't know why I said that. Um, so pretty much Von, Vondi, Treyarch, if you guys are watching this video right now. Uh, please share this note. Share this, share this info, and give us the answer why Mason's not in it. Because this will really help everybody, and this will actually give everybody the less hate on the campaign. And I haven't finished the campaign yet, so yeah. Anyway, anyways, and so yeah, that's all I gotta say for it. I know that wasn't too much I thought of. I just couldn't think of anything more because I was in school when I thought of all this. I was in school when I was in all this, so, so yeah, um, so pretty much, yeah, that's all I have for today, if you guys would want, want to have more of this stuff, please, please follow my Twitter, Instagram, Instagram, and, um, and subscribe to my channel, and like this vi, like this video, and like, and check out any other of my videos. And if you and if you still want this to happen of making th of me making theories of video games of why characters aren't in or anything else, just leave a comment and just say yes, I would want to see it or whatever. Whatever. Anyways, yeah, yeah. Well, this is gonna ramp up the commentary right now. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. But and enjoy enjoy some game gameplay of Advanced Warfare. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.